Rainbow's World. Today, we're gonna learn how to design a rainbow using the computer. Have you checked my YouTube channel? Please click on the subscribe button. Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna learn how to design a rainbow using PowerPoint. And all you need to do is press, I mean, click on PowerPoint icon. And then you press this, close. And go to blank presentation. You click on it. And then you type ROID B, an acronym to help you remember the colors of the rainbow. You press R, then O, then Y, then G, then B, then I, then V. And then you minimize it. Like this. And then you move it a little here. And you can minimize it a little more. And now you delete this one. Click on it. Then delete. And now you go to insert, click on insert, go to shapes, basic shapes, and you click on block arc. Then you click like this, and then you increase it. Let's just move it. Let's reduce it a little. And there. Let's come. And now we make it red. R is for red. You go to format. Go to shape fill. And you click on red. And then you press Ctrl D. You press Ctrl first, then D. And now we make it yellow. Go to shape fill. I mean, we make it orange. O is for orange. And now we reduce it. And the biggest one needs to be bigger. The one at back. Let's just reduce it like this. Let it come here. And now let's press Control D. Control then D. And now let's make it yellow. Y is for yellow. Go to Format, Shape Fill, look for yellow, and click on it. And now you reduce it to make it smaller. Wait. Smaller like this. And now you press Ctrl D, Ctrl then D. And now you go to Format and make it green. G is for green. Go to Shape Fill and click on green. And now you need to reduce it. Use it like this. Let's there. And now let's press Ctrl D. 
Control then D. And now let's go to format and make it blue. B is for blue. There we go. And now let's reduce it. That's okay. And now let's press Control D. Let's just shift this higher. That's okay. Now let me press Control D. Control then D. And now you go to Format and make it the color indigo. I is for indigo. Go to Shape Fill. Click on More Fill Colors. And pick indigo. And you say OK. Then it turns the indigo. And now you reduce it like that and now you duplicate it control then D and now we need to bake it I mean make it violet V is for violet go to shape fill and violet looks like this. And now we reduce it. Make it smaller. And that's okay. And now we pick the clouds we're gonna make the clouds go to insert go to shapes basic shapes and you see cloud here just click on it and click again then increase it and you can even duplicate it before making them white press control Control then D. And now let's make them white. Go to shape fill. And you look for white. Just click on it. And you make the other one white. Go to format. Shape fill. Click on white. And now you put it on this side of the rainbow and let's make it a little bigger to cover this part that's okay and let's make this other one bigger too there now let's put it here and now it's time to make the sun. Go to insert. Then you go to insert. Go to shapes. Basic shapes. And you click on sun. Once it's across, now make the sun. And this yellow thing makes it slimmer. Let me make it bigger. Let me just move it to this side. There. I think that's okay. Let's make it a little slimmer. Mm, there. Now let's put it on top here. And let's make it yellow. And then we're going to put a smiling face. Yellow. Now, let's just go to Insats. Click on Insats. Go to Shapes. Basic Shapes. And you click on Smiling Face. 
And now we make it smaller. There. And let's just make it a little smaller. There. Now let's make it yellow. Go to formats. Go to shape fill. See, click on yellow. And then you add it to the sun. Just move it here. There you go. And now it's time to put the raindrops. Go to insert. Go to shapes. Basic shapes. And you click on this teardrop. And now you make it smaller. Let's make it a little smaller. And there. Now let's duplicate it. Press Ctrl D to make a li little more. There. Now it's many. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve raindrops. Now we add it here. And then add the second one. The other one. And you can add some here. We're on it we're on it out of teardrop. I mean raindrops. Let's lick a little more. Make a little more. There. Let's add some here. And there. And there. There. You add some here. And you add some here too. And now here, and you add one here. So let's delete these four. First, delete, delete. Delete and delete. Wow, can you see this? Beautiful, right? And now let's group it. And this is how you group this. Wait, let me just do it again. Wait, these raindrops have missing spots. Let's do that again. You can even group it with Roy Beef, but we can't do that. There. And now. So now let's group it. Like this. Wait, let's just do it again.
Hmm. That's just got a missing spot. Let's do it again. There. And now, let's right-click. Group. You press. Click on group. Let's check if it's grouped. Wow, it's moving. Can you see that? It groups. So, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Bye, see you next time.